What's up, goons? How you doing? We're playing some Killing Floor solo, hard short, on Manor. But, I'm not going to be talking about Killing Floor. I'm going to be talking about Guild Wars. Uh, you may have heard of it. If you enjoy computer games, you've probably heard of it. It is a MMORPG uh, based in the... What is it? Medieval? medieval? Not medieval times. There's swords and there's armor and there's spells and magic and all that good shit. And uh, I had the biggest boner over that game for like the first six months I had it. I loved it and I couldn't put it down. And um, then that just, it got boring. And uh, I'm going to tell you why it got boring. I already got fucked up, didn't I? I already got fucked up. Let me help. 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 I already got fucked up. That was embarrassing. Alright, <laughs> new start. Um, I really hope they fix in Guild Wars 2. Let's start with the beef. The combat was just... Oh, man. It wasn't fun. After the first six months, you realize it came down to a system for me. You run out, you go to a mission, you're like, Okay, how can I do this mission while avoiding the red dots on the minimap? And if I do encounter the red dots on the minimap... How can I uh, fight them doing the least amount of effort? You just stand there, you hit C space, your dude fights them, and you click 1 through 9, or however many skills there were, 1 through 8, and you just sit there, and then when that guy's dead, you hit C space again, and go through the same set of skills. And it was very monotonous and very boring for me. It just it killed my boner hardcore. And I think they fixed that in Guild Wars 2. Eight days, by the way, if you uh, have it pre-ordered. You must be stoked. Oh, said time. Giblets, giblets all around. Um, yeah, there's dynamic combat now, I guess. Like, you move. Like, if you're using a gun, you can run around the person. Or a bow, you can run around and shoot them. And um, I really hope it plays well. Uh, my friend, Dino Mackish, uh, go check him out. Search him up on YouTube. He plays a lot of Guild Wars. Uh, he has the beta for a while. And uh, he has a couple videos up. I don't see much dynamic combat in his videos. Maybe that's just because uh, of the class he's playing or the characters or his play style or something. I don't know. But, um, yeah, I'm, I bet they fixed it. I bet it's good. I bet I'm going to enjoy it. And another thing I did not like was the quests. I would get a quest, or a whatever, a mission, not a mission, a quest, and it would be in my quest log, and I'd click it, and I could never accomplish it because it would not, like, come up with a star. When you select a quest in your quest log, it comes up with a star um, on your map. If you open up and your mini map telling you where to go. And half the time, over half the time, it felt like this asterisk would not be there. I would have no idea where to go. I'd have to go searching on the internet where to go. And it was just a huge pain in the ass because I'd either abandon the quest and it could have been a really fun one. No, oh, go save this slut from getting shanked in a bar or whatever. And I was like, oh, I want to go save this slut. And I can't do it because I don't know where the bar shanking is taking place take that bloat. Um, so that got pretty darn frustrating. And then two other little I'll things that soon. weren't too bad. Uh, you can't swim dead, in the first one. Uh, you can't go in the water. And you can't jump. So sometimes I would come up to a path, like a little mountain path, like right, I'll give you a good example. Like right here, in Guild Wars, some spots like this would be too steep to walk up. And you just run, and you, you'd stop. And then you'd see the goal. It's like right on the other side. And I couldn't I'll get to it. And I'd have to spend 20 minutes, 25 minutes, though. figuring out an alternate route around when I was at it uh, right away. Man, I gotta buy a fucking weapon. I've been talking too much. Is there one over there? Is that a weapon? Hell no, it isn't. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm so dead. I can't do this with just a pistol. Go, 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 go. I'm not going to make it. Give me something in there. Give me something in here. Please, anything. Uh, yeah, that was pretty much I'm just my Don't major beef. My major beef was the combat. The combat again. sucked. It got so boring. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Oh, my gosh. Oh, 
Hold on, I can't talk right now. I got shit on my plate. Oh. Where you at, girl? Where you at? I'm dead. 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 Reload. Well, <laughs> I tried. I was too focused on talking. I didn't get my lever action. Uh, that was basically it. Uh, combat quest not showing up. Can't jump. Can't go in water. Other than that, the game was great. Uh, I always enjoyed getting new weapons. It felt like your birthday. I enjoyed the the mini mini pets uh, that they give you uh, on your account anniversaries. I enjoyed everything about it. I enjoyed the armor. The graphics were good. The game, the game, <laughs> the game ran great. And uh, I just, I really hope Guild Wars 2 goes over well. I'm gonna pre-order it. Uh, I'm probably gonna get my check on Monday, and I'll pre-order it then. I'll be playing on the 25th, non-stop. I really hope it satisfies. Even if it, uh, even if I'm gonna have a boner over it for six months anyway. Just raging rock hard. Uh, more than the first one. Underwater missions, man. That sounds awesome. Uh, anyways, I'm not gonna play through this again. Uh, maybe I should. Let's play till I die. Let's just keep going. Oh, yeah, <laughs> just... That didn't take too long. I got too many grapplers on me. I actually could have made that out if I didn't give up so soon. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed my take on Guild Wars. Hopefully, Guild Wars 2 will be better. Take it easy.